Creative Cloud makes working across multiple computers or setting up a new computer a breeze by synchronizing your preferences, your presets, and other settings all through Creative Cloud. In fact, when you first launch Illustrator CC, a dialog appears inviting you to sync your settings for the first time. If you choose Sync Settings Now, it will automatically upload all preferences and presets. Disable Sync Settings disables all syncing but can always be enabled by going to Preferences, which is exactly where this Advanced button takes you. Now, Preferences is a good place to see all the options that can be synced. Things like your workspaces, brushes, swatches, and styles, just to name a few. You can then select Sync Settings Now to sync all your current settings. Then you can continue to work in the app and make changes to any of the settings, like creating a new workspace. You can then sync your settings directly from the document bar without interrupting your workflow. Now that your settings are synced to the Creative Cloud, you can use those same settings on another computer. And it can be a Mac or PC. It doesn't matter. Just launch the app on the second computer. The new settings you synced from your first computer are automatically detected on your second one, but will only be applied if you want them to. As you can see, my custom workspace is available, as well as any other settings I've defined on my first computer. If I make any changes, like adding a color in the swatches panel, for instance, I can sync those settings back to Creative Cloud. Now, back on my first computer, it will ask me if I want to keep local, which means it will keep my settings the way they are, or sync remote, and the color I added on the other computer will appear, as well as any other settings I've made on my second computer. And I can sync my settings in other apps like Flash and Dreamweaver. In Dreamweaver, for instance, it will sync my settings and my site definitions, so I don't have to worry about setting up each site definition separately on the other computer. Or if an IP address changes for a site, I just have to change it in one place and it gets synced everywhere. It gets even more interesting for the video apps like Premiere Pro and After Effects, because you can sync settings from any Creative Cloud account. Just launch After Effects, and you'll have the option to sync settings now, or you can use the sync settings from a different account. Select this option to switch to another account and use its settings. This is nice if you're working in a production company that has specific render settings you want to share. This gives you that consistency across all computers. And what gets synced are the keyboard shortcuts, render settings, and composition settings, just to name a few. Sync settings not only makes it easy to work on multiple computers, but also gives you the peace of mind knowing that you always have a backup of your preferences and settings stored on Creative Cloud. But this is just one aspect of Creative Cloud, so I encourage you to explore all that Creative Cloud has to offer.